Hi and welcome to the Nintendo Hub with me, Sparky. Welcome back if you're a subscriber and welcome to the channel if you're new. Now, one of my favorite games of um, last year was Toma Photo Adventure and they've just brought out some free DLC, which I haven't had a chance to check out. So I've just um, installed the update and I know you have to go to the first level to visit your nan to find out what the extra content is uh, here on Homelander. So let's first of all, pop into the house. She looks like she's at home, the chimney's smoking away and see what the DLC might include. Played this game a while back on this channel. If you haven't seen the link, I'll attach it to the end of this film. But it's one of my favorite games, um, favorite games of the, of the last year. I had great fun playing it. Might be seven or eight hours playthrough time. Doesn't outstay its welcome. Very unique system of using a camera to uh, solve challenges and do little quests. And visually, I thought it looked amazing. So um, let's see what the DLC includes, shall we? Good morning. I went to got us a couple of tickets to Basto. It's about time we go on a vacation. Take the bus to, to Stanham. Then follow the signs to the Viking Express. It will bring you over here in a hurry. Okay, so that's what I need to look out for when I go there. A cute picture of the Viking helmet. Don't forget to bring the ticket I left you. Okay, got the ticket. Okay, now love you loads too. Okay, so let's head off to Stanham. DLC, by the way, for this game was free. Um, and it's great to see developers doing that, just rewarding their players with extra content. Um, I haven't played this for a tiny bit, so just familiarizing myself with the controls. So I have to get the bust yet to stand him. And which was here? Let's travel there. If you played this game before, let us know your thoughts. Uh, I really, really enjoyed it. I think it's very well received by anyone who's played it. So here I am. Uh, if you haven't seen this before, you can revolve the whole little landscape here at 360 degrees and zoom in and zoom out really quite close onto smaller details that you need to look out for. And the main object of the game is to use your camera, which you can see here. Just got a nice bit of a nice zoom, probably digital zoom, I guess. And uh, just take pictures. Uh, it's got a little honk creature, <laughs> which can scare animals away in case you need to do something. Uh, you can do selfies. You can use filters on the pictures. It's brilliant. Okay, so we need to look for signs now for the Viking. And you can see there, I believe. There's the sign. Someone now told us to go this way. A very mellow soundtrack in this game. It's, it's, it is a relaxing experience. Okay, follow the signs again. It's quite straightforward down to the boat. Oh, who's this little fella? You got a ticket? Yes, you do. Want to go to Basto? Absolutely. Hop on. I don't know anything about the DLC, um, but this is my first time seeing this. It'd be really interesting to see what they've done. Welcome to Basto. Achievement completed. Tropical Paradise. Okay, let's see what our little fella says here. A warm place in the cold land. I've been sure to follow your journey. What an adventure it's been. But the question is, are you ready for another one? Absolutely. Love the energy. He's giving me a water popper attachment. Launches water balloons and splash everything. Does that go on the camera? That, my friend, is a water popper attachment. Hit the target over there with a the water balloon. Open your camera and swap out the hunk. Okay, let's try this then. So I think we go into the um, camera mode. And I'm pressing Y to swap out the hunk for the splash. 
Okay, press A for splash. Oh, okay. That's a mechanic they didn't have with the game, the uh, the original game. You with the DLC. Okay, got eleven balloons to find. Yeah, to complete each level, basically, you had to collect a number of stamps by completing quests. And you need to like seven stamps to get the bus of next level, or eight to the next level, and there might be twelve stamps, we don't need to complete them all. And generally if you just take pictures as you're going around, it's like of this cute little fella here. Oh I didn't <laughs> take a picture there, sorry. Big bird. You can fill up your album. And my album actually was looking quite chock a block. Uh, I'm gonna close that page, I don't too many see too many spoilers there. And as you go through, like, you just you fill up your photo album here. Lots to do. And mechanics are using the camera are good fun as well. Okay, let's let's have a wonder. Let's see what's in this. Zoom in, change my angles. Yo, looking for buy a jet ski. Uh, no thanks. What do you mean? Jet ski is life. That's good, isn't it? <laughs> okay, so he wants me to take a picture of his brother there doing some stunts, I guess. Let me quickly get my camera and take a picture of this. This. Fellow here. Water Strider. That takes me back to um, Super Mario Sunshine, actually. A lot of those around. Everyone you speak to pretty much just gives you something to do. Okay, so let's get on camera right now and see if we can take a nice shot of um, your man doing his stunts. Oops. No, I don't want to save that one. I pressed that by accident. I wanted to zoom in. Come out a bit more. Here we go. Save that. Now, if we go back to his brother. Show him the... not that picture. Oh, did I not save that last picture to the album? Let's do that again. I wasn't that impressed by that picture anyway. Let's try to get a better one. Maybe zoom in a bit more. Save the album, yes. Maybe try the same picture, maybe just from this angle. Okay, we'll get a nicer angle here, watch this. Yeah, there we go, that's the one. Actually, my album takes 256 pictures, and it looks like I've used 251 pictures. So I might need to delete some shots. Where is the picture I just took of the, um... Uh, oh, here we go. Let's show him this one. And there's a stamp. Bosch. So we've got the balloons to get. We've got the guy's ice cream to find. And when you consider this game just uses the camera to ask you to solve some of the puzzles. I mean, it's pretty creative, isn't it? When I'm here, let's have a look around for... Uh, oh, was that one of the balloons? No. Let's take a I think I've already taken a picture of one of these birds. Big bird. I know, I'm going to keep my original shot. I like that more. He's looking for an ice cream. What's this? There's a water pump. That must be for the flowers. So 
So it doesn't look like the water's getting through to the flowers. Let's wander off over here. Pull out first. Take a slow spin, see what we can see. Push in. Very nice. Let's get my camera and take some pictures of what's ever in these trees. No, I don't want to save that. I just wanted to zoom in first. Looks like... What's going on in here? I'll pull out a bit. Yeah, I'm not sure what they are. I could maybe replace the... Let's use the splash thing. Let's see what happens with the splash thing, actually. Well, there we go. And we have found one of these magic jelly beans. A bee nut, a tropical fruit. Okay. There's lots of little objects you just interact with, like chairs that spin around. That's all they do, but it's all good fun. Let's see who's in this tent. It's a big, it's a bit like the TARDIS, this tent, isn't it? You're here, this isn't this my nan? I forgot about my nan. A little worried you were going to miss my note. Okay, where should I take a nap on the sofa? Oh, here's the bed. Let's wander over here. Yeah, I'll take a nap. Why not? Absolutely. I wonder how long I slept for. Still tired. Ah, see that? Just taking a nap there gets me a stamp. That's good. We'll do. Let's have a look outside and see how things have changed. But let's see what's in this present for us. Let's pop in here. A sun hat. Thank you very much. You can actually <laughs> uh, equip clothing. Yeah, you can change your. There's a few things you can you can wear actually. Um, let's have a look here at my clothes here. Look, all these different hats I can wear here. Diving helmets. Let's stick on the diving helmet. There we go. We've got my hot dog sort of hot bean hat. There's different boots you can wear. I mean, it's all it's all pretty sweet. And oh, there's a picture I just took of the guy doing a stunt. He's made the poster over already. He's printed that pretty quickly. Okay, let's pop outside. It's night time now. Let's see how different it looks. Whoa, it looks like I'm floating in space here. Okay, so what's this thing over here? Uh, where was that? There's the moon. Didn't I see this thing? What's this? Is that a balloon? And you get these little um, worm-like characters popping up here. Beach snake, got him. Okay. There's a hidden little stair, a ladder here down to what looks like a bit of black sand. No, oh, I'm gonna speak to him. No, oh, just petting him there. Look. Nice. And I could probably take a picture of him here as well. Mud frog. The music is really lovely, isn't it? Okay, I didn't see this before. There's another ladder I can wander down here. So I go across and up. And there's one of those floating sort of TV balloon type things up there. I'm not quite sure what they are. It's a, it's a beautiful game, isn't it? And the music's, the music's beautiful as well. It's a good word to describe it. It's just so relaxing. Painting's a passion, but right now I feel a hurdle. I can still paint, but it's not as fun anymore.
Ooh. So you have to give her a portrait, do you? The painter's looking for a beautiful portrait to merge with her abstract style. Okay. Um, okay. Yeah. So you need an abstract looking portrait. Okay. This castle looks quite interesting. Let's wander in here if we can. Most of the buildings you can wander into. The royal family is napping. They've introduced a day night cycle in this game, which is pretty cool. Is that the same for this tower? I'm not sure what your main character is supposed to be here, but he's pretty cute. There's somewhere else I can sleep. Uh, there's a lantern here. Nah, I'm not gonna save that picture. There's a chair. Just sit there and chill. Guess that's what you do in chairs. I wasn't expecting much else. Okay. Let's quickly go to the daytime and then I'll pop into that castle and take a look inside there. I think it's morning time. Hopefully we'll wander outside. See the sun shining, the blue skies. Here we go, let's pull out. New music has been added to your hike, lady. You can change the music in this game as well. Um, can I do that now quickly? Because it was a really cool track I found in another level. Which I thought was great. I really, it was brilliant. Um, let me find it for you. It was like a uh, rat skull theme. Was this it? Yeah, check this out. raise those levels a bit for you gives everything a very different feel doesn't it they are red skulls okay this looks very interesting who's this I can't talk to this person I could take a portrait maybe Yeah, I'll save that. Oh, he wants ice cream as well. Okay. What do we have here? These look like sandcastles. Is this like a sandcastle building competition they've had here? Uh, I'm guessing. Let's have a look what they've done. Oh, something just popped up there. Oh, it's just the gates when you get near them, is it? What's this? Is he getting away there? Oh. Okay, let's see what's up here. King and Queen by the looks of it. I'll be a judge. Absolutely. Put your top three sandcastles in the frames behind me. And let me know when you're ready. So how do I do that? So I need to take three pictures, I believe, if I've got space in my inventory. So I'm going to go for this one. This is quite original. One. I've only got two pictures left in my album, so this is it works well for the three. This is a classic castle, I think. So let's put that in there. Yep. Why does he keep appearing when I take a picture? He's upside down now, no. Do I need to get an ice cream to get rid of this guy? Because he's, he's ruining all my photographs. Oh, he's there again. Uh, yeah, I think I need to get him an ice cream for this guy to disappear. Because if I look at my album... Uh, I've just got... No, he's in, he's in all the pictures, look. Okay. Annoying person, but I need to find a my script for him and for the other person at the front. Well, look, it looks like there's lots to do here. It looks like it's um, well worth getting back into just to finish this level. I'm not sure how many more levels there are. It could just be this one. But any time developers are releasing extra content, particularly for free, 
On a quality title like this, it's worth jumping into. Hey, he's making ice cream. He's got four cones, he's out of fruit. Yeah, I can give him fruit, haven't I? Because I picked up the um, those berry jubbies earlier on. The bee nuts. Can I give him the bee nuts? How do I give him a bee nut? Hey, there's the ice cream. Let's quickly go back and give this to the fella who's annoying me in the castle, see if this works. Here he is. Okay, my ice cream. Okay. Hopefully he'll be out of my face for a little while. Let me just do this this um this challenge with the sand castles and we'll we'll call this a day looking at the DLC. I'll definitely be playing on there and try to finish this level. Okay, is he full? Good. You gonna keep out my way? Excellent. Let's go and delete quickly a couple of pictures because I don't think delete. I have yeah, delete, thank you. Delete. Yep. Delete, yep. Uh, I don't need that picture anymore. I took three of these, didn't I? Let's get rid of that one. And that one. Okay, and let's go and take some pictures of the sandcastles I thought were best. This sandcastle to me looked pretty good. No, I want to take a bit back to picture with that. Let's zoom in some more. Bosh. Yep, that's good. And let's take... I'm not sure if it makes any difference, really, in what they can... You know, if they actually... You know, which pic which three pictures of the three sandcastles you take pictures of. Let's save that one, and let's go to this sort of pyramid-looking one here. Okay. So we have our three pictures. Uh, let's have a chat with our lovely-looking queen here. Hello again. Are you satisfied with your choices? Fairly satisfied. Oh dear. You seem to have gotten to fill in all the winners. Okay. So, frame picture, yes. This is first place, I guess, in the middle. And we're giving first place this creative boot. Uh, this is the lowest one, so it's third place. And I'll give this to the classic sandcastle. And for the silver prize, I shall give it to the pyramid. If I pop back and see here. Yeah. See what happens here. Maybe the other fella might do something now. The time has come to announce the winners of the castle building competition. In third place we have the stronghold. And receiving second place we have a pointy top. I present to you the pyramid. And in first place, we have the winner of the grand prize, the King's Royal Cape. Oh. A sand cabbage shoe. A royal cape, lovely. Equipped clothing? Oh, I've taken the king's cape. A good example of one of the more interesting little challenges there. It wasn't too difficult to do, but it was fun doing it. Until next time to you. Okay, thank you very much. Just could come out of the building. What's this? Oh, just sit in a chair. Here are all these little people wandering around. I sure when I'm here, I might as well take a quick picture of these guys. There's a look at their little bums. I don't know bum. I want their turn around for me. I'm gonna turn around. Yeah, I thought that might register or something, but 
I've got a picture of those guys. Let's quickly wander out. So let me know what you think about the DLC. If you've got the game, you have to play it. I mean, it's free. It's an adorable game. If you haven't got the game, I'm not sure the price is now. It wasn't a full price game. I think it was 12 or 13 pound or 15 dollars or something, but it's well worth picking up. It's a gorgeous little title. DLC is great. Music is great. Controls are great. Graphics are great. It's a fun game to play. It makes you smile. And what more do you want from a video game? If you like what we're doing here at the Nintendo Hub, please give me a subscribe and a like because I'm um, just trying to uh, introduce you to games you might not have played before or maybe you have played before and just play them for a little while, chat about them and see what you think. Really appreciate you watching today and I hope to see you again soon on the Nintendo Hub. Thanks from me, Sparky. Bye-bye.